What is pancreatic cancer? Cancer begins when cells start to grow out of control. This can happen in any part of the body. When this happens to cells from the pancreas, it's called pancreatic cancer. This can happen to both exocrine and endocrine cells of the pancreas, but pancreatic cancer with exocrine cells is more common. It is important to know when the tumor is exocrine or endocrine. It is not clear what causes pancreatic cancer, but it starts when cells grow out of control and rarely starts in the hormone-producing cells of the pancreas. Some symptoms of pancreatic cancer are upper abdominal pain, loss of appetite, weight loss, depression, and blood clots. Doctors can see if you have pancreatic cancer by doing imaging tests to take pictures of your internal organs, using a scope to create ultrasound pictures of your pancreas, using a scope to inject dye into the pancreas ducts, and removing tissue samples for testing. Once you have been diagnosed, the doctor checks to see how progressed the cancer is. Imaging tests may include CT, MRI, and blood test. The first step to treatment is trying to eliminate all of the cancer. Doctors do surgery procedures to remove the tumor as an option as well as radiation and chemotherapy. The prognosis is difficult, but earlier diagnosed cases have higher survival rates. You are more at risk for pancreatic cancer if you have excess body weight, pancreatitis, family history of the BRCA2 gene, Lynch syndrome, and atypical mole malignant melanoma. To, pre to prevent pancreatic cancer, you can maintain a healthy diet and weight and not smoke.